Tonight is a very special night for the local enterprise offices because around the country we're celebrating 20 years of winners of these our national enterprise awards and the 19 previous winners are going to be here tonight to be celebrated for their continuing achievements which include 832 jobs in those 19 companies, turnover of 131 million and the export to up to 52 countries. We're based in the 26 counties in the 31 local authorities and it's not just the financial supports but it's the advisory supports, the one-to-one -one mentoring, the development uh, training that we can give our clients that's so important. And I think in Jeremy's case the supports and the advisory supports that he would have received in 1998 are very different from those that are available to us now because we have to move with the challenges mm -hmm. that our clients are facing. 2008 was a pivotal year in our development in that we won the awards here, the LEO award should I say, and also uh, we moved to a new building, a purpose-built training, uh, training centre at the logistics part. We trade currently globally, probably 40 countries worldwide, and 95% of our business comes in from abroad. I'm always a friendly voice at the end of the phone and continuous advice if we need it. So um, can't really compliment him enough, Oshin and his team have been amazing help to us and we hope we're now paying back some of that goodwill. Applied for the Enterprise Awards and, and thankfully uh, qualified through to the national finals. Um, little did we know we'd end up being the overall winner in 2005 and obviously that was a massive boost to the company. Um, we've grown since, we've over 20 people employed by the company now. Uh, we're in three continents, we're in or Ireland, UK, Europe. Uh, so it's been a very um, successful experience for us not just in terms of how we've grown the company domestically, but how we've grown the company internationally. And uh, I think the Enterprise Awards are a great uh, source for any company that are coming through to, to gain inspiration for growing their business. Yeah, we had a wonderful winner a number of years ago called uh, Walsh Whiskey. Uh, they actually went on to invest over 25 million in the distillery in the Royal Oak in Carlow. Uh, again, they're exporting to a large number of countries, employing over 50 people now at this stage. So they were a wonderful testament to what the local enterprise office can do. Mm -hmm.